Hello guys, how are you doing today? Are you good? I hope so. So, this class we're going to work on August 4th, but before we start, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, activate the notifications to keep improving your English, all right? So, the text brings some fun facts about Barack Obama, okay? He speaks some Indonesian, he has already done drugs while a teenager, and he's graduated of Harvard Law School, okay? So let's take a look at the verbs. We have to be, to have, to be born, to speak, to learn, to eat, to consider, to elect, to gain, and to receive, okay? Now, guys, we're going to go to the home practice. Home practice are on pages 320 until 322, okay? In this first exercise, we're going to have Junior talking about what's there inside the White House. You're going to use your imagination, okay? So we have a possible answer here. Let's take a look. There are many rooms and offices filled with the current president stuff, okay? Senior, you have to talk about what is the video about, okay? So what's, what was there in Barack Obama's house at that time, okay? So, it's cut from an interview Barack Obama gave to Kimi, Jimmy Kimmel where the president is asked about his routine at the White House. There were clocks, a kitchen, and a, de a dentist chair with equipment, okay? Master, you have to summarize the video. So, it's cut from an interview Barack Obama gave to Jimmy Kimmel, where the president is asked about his routine at the White House. They talk about things the president had the liberty or time to do, and the things other people did for him, okay? Now, guys, we're going to go to our review. This review, we're going to talk about there plus to be, okay? And we're going to contrast it with to have, because in Portuguese, we tend to believe both of them work the same, but they don't, okay? When we are talking about there plus to be, we talk about existence and to have, we're talking about possession, okay? There plus to be in this class, we're going to work with the simple forms. So we're going to use there plus to be in the present, the past, and the future, okay? When we're using there plus to be in the present, we use there is for singular and there are for plural. In the past, we use there was for singular, there were for plural, and finally, in the future, we use there will be, okay? So, let's take a look at the examples. We have one example, which is, there are plenty of landmarks in Rio de Janeiro that needed to gain attention from the public. We also have, there are people visiting Rio de Janeiro every month of the year. Negative, we have, there aren't well-preserved parks to receive tourists in Brazil. There weren't tourists eating local food before the place was renovated. And in the interrogative, we're going to use, is there any nice place to visit in the countryside of Brazil? Will there be people considering France as a destination if it has changed so much, okay? Guys, that's it for today. Don't forget to come to our live classes, okay? It was a pleasure to be with you and see you next time. Bye-bye.